Hello everyone, how are you? Hope you're having a good day, like I am. If I'm a bit hot and sweaty, it's because I've just come back from the gym, quite literally, so uh, I'm still dripping with sweat. But I wanted to do this review very quickly before I've got other things to do. But um, came through the letterbox the other day. I didn't put it on my latest DVD update because I just wanted to talk about this specially, but it is the brand new Grindhouse releasing release of uh, the infamous Cannibal Holocaust on Blu-ray. Now, I'm not going to go through the film because, to be honest with you, if you're watching this video, you've probably seen Cannibal Holocaust a million times like me. And as a, if you haven't, then check out a review video because there's plenty of them on here. So if you want to find out about the film before and in depth, then watch one of the other reviews because um, there's plenty of them on YouTube. But I'm just going to talk about the Blu-ray specifically. Now, um, uh, this isn't the first time it's been out on Blu-ray. Um, it has been out on Blu-ray. Uh, if you're living in the, in the UK, then you will be aware that it's been out on Blu-ray over here via Shameless. But uh, that was um, a different cut of the film. Diodato, the director, went back and did a new edit of it back in uh, 2012, and he cut some of the animal violence. So some of it really was to appease the BBFC over here because we still have censorship problems in this country, albeit to a lesser degree than we used to years ago, but that's another discussion. But um, uh, he cut some of the animal violence, which uh, he didn't like anyway, so um, it was a slightly trimmed down cut of the film, but all the gore and all that, that sort of aspect of it was all intact. Um, and it had some features. So I thought the transfer was pretty good. Some people moaned about it, but I thought it was all right to be honest with you. So um, anyway, but Grindhouse releasing um, really back on track in the last few months. They've been releasing I think four or five films now over the course of the last year. Um, they've got around to releasing this, um, so I had to do an upgrade um, because the Shameless one was a little light on features, although it did have some features that were quite interesting. But this has got a bucket load of features. Plus you get the CD soundtrack with it as well. So uh, anyway, it comes in this uh, slipcase. As you can see, that's the slip case, and that is the box. It's a two disc set, well it's actually a three disc set, but I'll get onto that in a minute. You get this lovely little booklet here. The booklet came a little bit creased actually, I think it's a bit too big for the holder, but um, this one, sorry, this one is the uh, cut of the film, Blu-ray. And this too is the extra features. But that is not all. Along with that, you get the CD soundtrack as well. Now, they did the CD soundtrack uh, grindhouse with the Big Gun Down um, Blu ray, but they actually put that soundtrack in the uh, main box itself. But they haven't done it with this, they've put it in a little card wallet which fits inside here. So I suppose they've done that because you might want to just stick it in your CD collection or whatever, but um, I'll leave it in here. So um, I looked on Amazon actually the other day just to see what the um, CD soundtrack was uh, was going for, and I think it was like um, over £10, uh, so I don't know what that will be if you're in America. Um, I know the Big Gandam, um uh, soundtrack was actually out of print anyway, so it was, that was a really good little bonus for uh, Grindhouse to put that in. But um, anyway, that's it. Um, they haven't ported over all the special features from the previous Grindhouse DVD. Um, the hour and a half making of, um, that hasn't been ported over, um, and nor has the interview with... Uh, there was an interview with, uh, who am I missing now? Oh, Luca Barbareschi. Um, that is not on here. But um, pretty much all the old features that were on the Grindhouse releasing DVD are on here. Plus they've added some new stuff as well. There's new interviews. a brand new one hour interview with um, Ruggiero Diodato, the director, where he goes through his Cannibal Trilogy. Uh, Lost Cannibal World, Cannibal Holocaust and Cut and Run. Talks about all three films. Um, there's a fairly there's a cinema wasteland panel uh, which runs about half an hour. That is um, on here as well, which with Dear Dato, David Hess, and uh, a couple of the actors from Cannibal Holocaust, amongst others. Um, there's an interview with can't remember the guy's name now, but he played Chaco the guide in, in Cannibal Holocaust. If you remember Chaco the guide, uh, they interview him from Colombia. I think that runs about half an hour. Um, there's a couple other bits as well, plus all the stuff that was on the old DVD. It took me like a, a whole evening just to get through it, plus the two commentary tracks, plus, you know, 
booklet CD, so um, well worth the money in my opinion. Now, as to the transfer of the film, um, of course a lot of the reviews were based on the fact that no one had seen a previous Blu-ray of it. So, of course, everyone was like, had a bit of a wow factor. Of course, I didn't because I'd seen the Shameless Blu-ray. Um, it's hit and miss, really. Um, I've heard some people say they prefer the Shameless picture. I've heard some people say they prefer the Grindhouse picture. So, there's aspects of it. I think the Shameless, uh, I think the colour's a little bit better on the Shameless maybe the grindhouse just has the edge on clarity possibly but it's really apples and oranges to be honest with you at the end of the day there isn't really much in it um so anyway i'm not going to go on too much longer about it but definitely get this pick it up it's out now um one of the best italian horror films uh, ever made still shocking to this day so um anyway that's it for me thought just do a quick uh review of this and uh, hope everyone's all right and if you want to make a comment then leave it in the section below and uh, hopefully I'll see you all soon.